airport CEO. Dude, this thing makes sounds. Look at this. It just makes the menu completely unusable. Have a safe flight. New airport. Begin a new adventure. Yeah, see, they, they each say something funny when you... Or not funny. They just say something. Get back to work. Erase your past. Hmm, let's adjust them. Take control. Enhance. Graphics. What's annoying you? Wow. Make it custom. We would like to thank. And your options. Okay, there you go. Okay, this is the beginning of the game. Let's hit new adventure. Ooh. Randomizes it each time. What do we go with? There's some like computer options. Go with that. You now can we get like a blue in here? You know what I'm saying? It's gonna pop up a lot. Wiggly lion lips going on, you know? Suit. I'll go with that one. Butts. McGee. Got it. Oh, okay. Extremely cold. Wait, somewhere here it's at 69. Yeah, let's go to Nashville. Where is it? There you go. Done. Average? Humid? Is this just hard mode? Just like, I want to be here. You know, there's a, a surprising number of airports in the region, all things considered. Yeah, let's go to Nashville. All right, there, done. Airport name, but airport, three letter code, but <laughs> ass. Hmm. No, I saw it. Can't, we can't. Come on. We got to think of the children's. But. Airport butt. Damn, some of these look kind of hot. But. I like this one. It's this one or one of these circle ones. Like that one? I feel like that one's kind of fun. Airport management. We're going to go with easy. Alright, well, you know, first time playing, I feel like we got to go easy. This is what everyone loves watching. Someone play a management game for the first time, knowing nothing. Only good things can happen from here. Um, let me pull the Steam page up on my phone while it's loading. You know what I'm saying? So we can, we can talk through some of this dead air. Um, this, so for reference, also, this game is not new. Uh, but I'm just playing it now. Okay, here. Okay, sorry. Okay, just kidding. I was gonna. I, I, there are no progress. This is. Is this your first day on the job? Well, let's go through a short introduction together. Okay, this is the build panel where all airport-related structures can be found. Some objects are not yet available and need to be unlocked from the R and D panel. Got it. And this is the management panel shortcut tab. It is the most important panel in covering all aspects of being a CEO. First tab is dashboard. A general overview of the current status of your airport. Got it. 
Yeesh. Uh, okay. Already. Off to a great start. From the economy tab, you can view your budget and accept contracts, order new products, and take out loans. Mm. The operation tab allows you to toggle airport services as well as open the airport to allow general aviation to use your airport. From the constructor panel, you can deploy contractors to build your airport. The right of the airport is the ratings panel. Got it. Yeesh. Okay, uh, ho hover over the icons to learn each... Oh yeah, let's do it. Okay. General aviation satisfaction. Airline satisfaction. Passenger satisfaction. Security rating. Average airport. Something, something. Got it. It looks like you received an email from the mayor. Click the button to read it. Reminder, press tab to open the management panel and make sure you familiarize yourself with the various panels. Email is in here somewhere. Got it. Okay. How did he know? Oh, okay. There's a big fat one. Oh, okay. Welcome to your airport. You got a lot. Uh, thank you a lot for last meeting and I hope you like your new job. I know this isn't much at this point, but hopefully you'll do better than the last person that tried to build our town's proud airport. You had a lot of work ahead of you. Um, so you better get to it. I can't give you any tips because I don't really know how to run an airport, but let me remind you that you have a budget to keep, uh, and we count on you to get this place making a profit. Good luck. And we'll talk soon. Here's the most important thing you need to know. Press tab to access the management panel. Here's everything you need to know. Okay. Staffing, purchasing new products, operations, and more. This is your control panel as a CEO. Press H to access tutorial. We've quite challenging to build an airport. This might be of great assistance. We at the city want to get uh, a flying start. Haha. Ha. Shut the fuck up, dude. Okay. Not fucking funny. So I've asked a few people with inside knowledge of airports to contact. Uh, watch your email inbox. That's all. Best of luck. Thank you. Thank you. you know, press F on the leftmost icon. You open the flight planner. Okay, once you have signed your first airline contract and built an airport for commercial flights, this is where you'll schedule them. Okay, well done. There's so much more to learn by yourself from this point. You didn't teach me anything. Press H for the question mark on the bottom left panel to open the tutorial. If you ever need to view the current tutorial step and checklist, click next to construct your first airport. Okay. Well, that was silly. This is all the ground that I'm going to get. A oh, bigger airports. Okay. Airports are complex megastructures, so let's get to the start with a small airfield and learning the basics of airport operation. Remember that you can view the checklist at any time by pressing the checklist button next to the close button if you want to make sure you have completed the current steps. If needed, you can find a detailed tutorial panel in the management panel. Good luck. Okay, airports are complex. Wait. Oh, this is the delivery site. No. Okay, um, to sign a contract with a contractor, open the economy tab, contracts. Uh, contractors use construction material to build objects. The material is automatically ordered and delivered via trucks to the delivery site. Okay, sign a contract. Hourly fee per contractor. They have three stars though, you know what I'm saying? Uh, Brickley is an international construction group involving some of the biggest structures in the world, founded by Martin Brickley. Uh, in 1946, you think it, we build it. Please review the contract in detail before accepting. Okay, maximum contract is 108. The contractor promises to deliver skilled workers capable of construction address for blueprint contra contra contractors and deploy via telephone and require a contractor site. Okay, most of this seems the same. Let's let's do it. Done. Easy game. Okay. Deploy contractors. <clears throat> um let's see. Open the operations tab. This fucking max. Deploy. You know, I haven't told them to build anything. 
How did, how did they let me get here? It just doesn't reflect in the menu. What what do I need? Okay, they're here. What are they gonna do? I don't think I don't think they're gonna do anything. Time to get your hands dirty. Okay, let S get started. Hang on, there's like something freaking out over here. What do you want? The stream's audio bitrate is zero. It is? Why would you tell me that? No, it's not. You fucking liar. Okay. Um, <clears throat> the first your seat general aviation flight. The image below is an example of an airport design that is suitable for a GA operation. Okay, how do we get there? Place a small runway and wait for the construction material. Where do I fucking put that? Okay. Airplane. Place a small runway. Small runway. Oh, this is probably aircraft. Small runway. Oh, I see. Can we rotate? Yeah, no shit, the airport is closed, dude. Okay, air sign. Place two runway ramps. All right, where are those? <clears throat> runway ramp. Each side. Drag out a taxiway foundation from your runway map. Taxiway Foundation. How big does this need to be? Can it just be this? I'm assuming, so like the runway itself is five. I'm assuming it also should be, f oh shoot. Can I control Z? Okay, that's okay. We'll see, we'll see if that's fine. Okay, we need aircraft stands. Place at least five small stands. Two, three, four, five. Done. Wait for your construction of your taxiway. To improve airside traffic flow, set runway ramp direction by clicking on them and set the dryer operation. See to visualize. Taxiway paths. Hmm. Okay. Now we got the homies. They're here. Why are why are planes not flying? Do I need more zone here? Maybe I shouldn't have deployed them all. Was that a bad idea? Oh shit, dude, they're pounding out the runway. Look at this. Why did they go for the furthest thing first? Assholes. Was it a bad idea to just have all of the people here all at once? Or was that the best idea? For reference, I said the graphics do like fantastic or something crazy. Did I need to do that? Probably not. What is this? Is this pollution? Oh, they're boxes.
Wait, what's happening? What's this button do? Fast forward the next day. Oh, did we run out of materials? Wait a minute. I mean, I think they did it. Oh, let's check my mail. Mail. Okay. Butts Airport. My name is Anita. We met briefly at the mayor's office. Anyway, as you know, every once every a year the global aviation association comes together and votes on which of the world's top ranking airports that is awarded airport of the year of course the city really wants our new investment to do really well so please try and win that award for us winning the award is fairly easy if you put your mind to it you simply need to maintain an average airport rating of 95 percent over three years with a lot of passenger and aircraft throughput yes some may say that it's incredibly difficult but not for you especially not with the thorough recruitment process we had. Here's the full GAA committee checklist. Okay, average airport, okay. Yearly passenger throughput of at least 10,000 passengers. Okay. What, what is the problem here? Runway ramp not connected? I need some like What is this taxiway path? Is this what I needed? I mean, they told me to do this, but we done it. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah. Hmm. Is it gonna be better if if it's this way? Uh, we'll see. We'll see if it's a problem. I need to worry. About. Place a small ATC tower. Okay, small ATC tower. Got it. Dude. Minus a thousand per hour. I'm doing a bad job, I think. Done. Now it's time to accept your first flight. At the same, at this time, you can only accept general aviation flights. A small type of aircraft operated by private pilots as we haven't yet acquired the commercial license. First off, you need to ensure that the runway and the aircraft are open. And this is done. Have five GA flights land to complete this tutorial step. Hmm. Okay. Overview. Airport open. Got it. Allow general aviation. Okay. Open up the runway by left clicking the runway. Then open. Gamer. Wait for five flights to land. Got it. Did I tell some of these contractors to leave because they're not making anything right now?
did it. Do you make it? Running an airport's easy. I probably need to have like a break zone for them or something. You know, like what are they doing? Fucking nothing, dude. My name is Alejandro Tinto, and I work at the Senior Partner Executive Vice President within Management and Analysis. I'm reaching out to you because I've been recently appointed as CEO of the new airport. I wanted to give you some brief instruction performance reporting follow-up on how your airport is extremely important and something blah, 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 blah. There are four categories of performance, including rating, incident, and operations. Oh, economy. I didn't read that one. Anita has already told you about the ratings report, so I will dive into another. Here's how it's broken down. If you have a CFO hired at the end of each business day, they will send your report via email and your daily earnings and how you perform it against yesterday. If you have a COO hired at the end of each business day, they will send you a report on a number of incidents that occurred and again, perhaps some helpful tips that you can improve. That's all you need to know for now. We at uh, Accento Finance hope you feel right at home in your new office. Best of luck. Thank you. Okay. If land animals enter the runway, they can cause damage. Build fences around your airport to keep animals out. Got it. Basically, one face to get an easier contrast certain areas of the airfield. Okay. Uh, I don't think I needed that. Okay. Congratulations on your first functional airport. The GAA pilots are enjoying your airport, but some are concerned about the lack of airport refueling service. Let's get started in constructing all the required structures for basic refueling service. Place a checkpoint to the connected um, to connect public and service roads. Okay, this, and then what do you need? You need vehicle checkpoint. Where does this need to go? I'll just put it like right next to this. Oh, can I cancel this? Wait a minute. Damn it. Um, on here they have it right next to the thing. I'm assuming that I can do that too. Bring back the contractors in, by the way. Deploy. Okay, drag the service road. Okay. Drag the service road and connect to the checkpoint with your aircraft stands. Which one is that? Damn it. No. Is it this one? No. It's this one. Hmm. 
construct a vehicle depot or service vehicle parking lot. Okay. Can I rotate this? I guess I can just put it like this. These buttons are doing things and I'm not sure what. And I press them all. H is the cell phone. That's just dark. Okay. Place a small... Fuel depot and wait for the construction uh, of the structures to be built. Okay, I need this. Fuel depot. Yeah, like how do I rotate this? Rotate objects are. Oh, there you go. What is this? This is just... This is where fuel is stored? Okay, this is just storage. Alright, there you go. Done. No lights. No one can see anything, but that's okay. It's gonna be a really tight bottleneck. But that's okay. Probably just eat the hourly cost of these contractors staying on station. So I don't have to worry about it until we get kind of past the bulk of the tutorial. Hmm. All we need to do now is purchase a fuel truck and sign a contract with an aviation fuel supplier. Hmm. Vehicles. Order now. Done. I told you, running it, running an airport, easy game, dude. New product has arrived. Yeah, I wonder if I can't put a um sign a contract with an aviation fuel supplier. Economy offer contract fuel supplier. Done. Easy game. My money. All 
Okay, enable the refueling service. Open operations tab. Enabled. Okay, done. Refuel five aircraft. Dude, on it. I don't even have to do anything. They do it for me, right? Meow. Oh shit, 41 per hour. Making the big money. have I refueled? Oh, I'm losing money. No. Yeah, see, we should probably send some of these contractors home now. big project then we'll just call them back in i just feel bad because they're just standing there you know i don't have a break room or anything for them if i did you know a different story Okay, you know the basis of airport average. You continue to expand your airport for GA aircraft earning money from services. Okay. Drag out the terminal foundation. Hmm. least one bus stop. Hang on, I gotta like fucking rezone this stupid fence. Maybe I don't need to rezone this stupid fence. Or we probably will, but I'll do it later. Okay, place at least one bus stop and one car drop off and make sure they're connected to a public road. Okay. they really have it in here put the let's put the public road in first waiting to be over here this is the terminal I see Bus stop. What's stopping me from just like putting it right next to it? I'm assuming there's a reason. One car 
drop off. Okay, then I need a public road. space they put we're just gonna put a uh, one it's on the sidewalk walk off the terminal where is that sidewalk Open the heat map panel and have a look at where passengers and employees can walk. Heat map panel, huh? Got it. I need the contractors again. Deploy the contractors. Drag out a staff room. All right, where is this? How big does this need to be? offices and desks and any type of seating okay personal space they need hopefully not that much how much staff is working here it's like ambitious I feel as though I've lost a lot of money already. Most people are like, you gotta spend money to make money. I'm, I'm just spending money right now. There's no doors? I feel like, like I need that. Rotate the door. gonna need like doors to the outside I'm assuming I will
Now let's just see where that gets us. There, there will be at least doors in and out of the place. Also, I have like a staff room, but no staff. Love to see it. Decorate your terminal by putting in some new floors. Ah, here we go. Beautify with some nice plants. Get some ferns in here. We're gonna accept. We gotta put some burns right there. Got it. We're we gonna accept commercial airlines and handling as passengers. We need a commercial uh, license. Let's set up an office space and staff room for the airport administrators to work on R and D projects. Okay, hire at least two administrators, and they will work on R and D projects and unlock new objects and systems. Staff tab. Okay. I need two administrators. Oh, what's up? Dude, your bar is all the way green. Oh, you're a janitor. Okay, when I get to janitor, you're it. Hmm. Alright. Commercial license project in the R&D tab. Operations. R&D. Click to start new project. Commercial license. Start. Done. Dude, look at the offices, man. They're looking good. They're looking blue. Other other than that, we we have like a warehouse. Done, right? Done. Oh my god, let's watch what happens when it fills. Is it going to change color of the text? Oh, it's not. Okay, that's okay. What's going on with the planes? Look at Zombies, don't they look nice? For the two people that are working here? Who's this third person? Okay. Oh, that's me! Oh my god, there's no bathrooms. they tell me to make a bathroom soon. No, I'll make the bathroom now. How big does a bathroom need to be? remember that there's going to be like wall then we need 
door? Is that a door? No, this is a door. Right? And then, uh... I'm assuming that this comes with, like, some kind of divider situation. What if we make, like, a really funky bathroom in here? Super crazy. This is a 13 by 13 space, so this right here is the middle. Okay, what if we just do this, right? We make that bathroom for a Mission Impossible. And then we'll just put sinks. You know what I'm saying? And then we'll put hand dryers next to the exit. walls will be like all the bathroom units. This is a lot of space for a bathroom, I'm realizing. Okay, but I do need contractors again. Oops. Max it out. Get the get the get the boys in here. Oh, we can put a window in here, huh? And a window into the bathroom. Okay, great. Now when the outside is built. We should focus on the inside. Passengers will first enter the terminal. When they check into their flights, then they must uh, pass a security checkpoint in order to enter the secure perimeter of the terminal. Once the flight arrives, it will go through the aircraft via a boarding desk. Hmm. Place at least two small Check-in desks. Got it. If we put them, like, right here. We put it in three, you know, I'm feeling ambitious. Zone apart. It's suitable as secure. Probably the whole fucking thing, right? I mean, I don't know what I need this space for. When you're here, you're secure. Just like leave that extra area just in case. Place a few security checkpoints. I don't really know the flow here, so we're just going to put them, like, right in the middle. View. Place a security exit. Okay. 
There's a boarding desk. Next to each stand. Hmm. Where's that boarding desk? Some kind of door then, right? Let me move these. I'm just not sure if I'm going to be able to have them, like, leave immediately. Like, through that little doorway. I'm assuming we will. and enable commercial flights. Yeah. Click on each stand and enable commercial flights. How do I do that? Oh, dude, they did have stalls. Look at that. Click on each stand. Can't I do it? Oh, is it because I need this to be... Project manager down at the city office and I represent the nation's aviation administration. We want to reach out and congratulate you on your role, but remind you the responsibility to come with it at the aviation administration. We take security and safety very, very seriously. And we hope that you do too. Running an airport is a privilege only few get to experience. And now that you're part of the club, we want to run through a few do's and don'ts. You should hopefully already know by now. Once you expand your operation to include passengers, the government will start monitoring your security rating. Always try to maintain a high security an average security rating to avoid getting slapped with fines. If your average security rating is especially poor for a lengthy period, the government may revoke your commercial license and back to a GA airport only. Uh, the government will, from time to time, run unannounced random samples of your security setup to ensure that no passengers or baggage with dangerous Wi-Fi exception into your airport secure areas. If we discover foul play, you'll be slapped with a fine. Finally, if an airline discovers that a bag with a dangerous content was loaded on board an aircraft, 
or if a dangerous passenger boarded an aircraft, you will again be subject to the fine. Uh, all in all, we do just hope that you take security safely, just as seriously as we do. If any of the above scenarios occur, consider a distinguished incident and send uh, send you an email there. Okay. In short, if a commercial, okay, make sure you have a highly skilled security staff. If an airline finds a dangerous bag of passengers, if any of the above happens, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it. Hang on. So I I have. Oh, right here. Open your terminal, open your runway for commercial use. Where do I do that? Was oh, it this one? Staff room looks really nice, but it seems empty. Let's hire some friendly staff near your airport. Alright, I'm done building. Let me... All these people leave. Okay. Hire four passenger service agents. Okay. Staff. Passenger service agents. Air Force security officers. Where are they at? Security officer. Need four of you. Hired, hired. You're hired. You're hired. Four ramp agents. Wait for your staff to arrive via public transport. Got it. Okay. Enable ramp service. Okay. Operations. I finally have to accept the first commercial flight and get and greet some passengers. First off, we need to sign a master contract with an airline. Then the airline will offer flights that we can schedule in our flight planner. Accept a master airline contract. Dude, easy game, dude. This one? Okay. I guess we got Trinity Aviation. All flights to and from the election to tune. Okay, is dependent on successful execution of the contract plan. Well, okay. Done. Easy. Open the flight planner. Uh, click on the name that you see to the left. 
Let's see. To schedule a flight, drag it into the flight planner. Schedule flight, drag it into the flight planner. Am I not seeing it? Okay, open the flight planner. Click on the name. No flights offered yet. Okay, well, we're not doing anything. Look at these rain effects, dude. Shit. Does everyone have a desk? Are we good? Dude, why don't you use the bathroom? Why is it closed? Oh, wh what? Lights not yet offered. This thing's dirty. Did you clean it? What am I supposed to do? Do I take out another contract with a airline? How do I make their other meter go up? You know what I'm saying? Walk a later. <laughs> Walk a later. There's still a flight? No. You can't make like a multi-floor airport. Look at that. 
I don't know what to do about this. This is so silly. Ba, 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 ba. What if I just sim to the next day? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, it's happening, it's happening. There you go. Now we did it. Why, why am I doing that? <laughs> okay, so this is also clearly like a massive security problem, right? I clearly need to do like this. We'll put some we'll put some big windows in. And then we need the we need the contractors. Get in here, make the windows. We'll deal with the other part like after or something like that. broken. <laughs> I'm really glad I did that. Wait, wait, wait. Where are things happening? Done. I'm like really worried that there's just going to be some kind of issue. Like with the plane, you know? Like I don't know what's gonna happen, but something's gonna happen where for me to have it that close is just going to become a problem. just to make it I 
just have one on station, and then, you know, if things happen, then we'll get it sorted out. What is happening here? Tends to plant, huh? It's almost like you should have a person hired to do it. Oh my god, they're here. This is the commercial airline situation. Responsibility. <laughs> All right. When when did they get to board? something is going wrong. People are there for the next flight. Wow. Okay. Maybe we should get them some some seating. laptop table. There you go. What does this mean? Oh yeah, okay, here's the issue that I thought would happen. No bathroom inside the terminal. Let's fix that. Do you like that? How 
all of this? And then, uh, you know, I got, a, I got bathroom stuff in there. Probably templatize this. side and the bathroom in the middle is six tiles wide okay we'll have the same bathroom layout inside Contractors in here to uh, let's get this bathroom situation sorted. Like whenever I make something substantial, I feel like you know the boys can come in. bathrooms. I don't even know if they really need it. Where do we have outside windows in the terminal? Hmm. I know they have nothing, right? Piece of candy. I wonder if it'll let me put it like if there's conflicts at some point later down the week or something. Let's see what's up with these laptop stands. We put two of them? It's three. Hmm. 
Do they need like stools or something? Not really sure what the deal with those is. It's like a big space for one commercial area. <clears throat> How much more lucrative are the There you go. How much more lucrative are the commercial airliners? Probably way more, right? What are we waiting for? Turn around another five commercial flights. Why can't I queue it to become commercial? You know, like once we finish this, then. And I want it to be a commercial line or whatever. Oh no, the problem here. Object is filthy. No janitor is hired. All right. Time to hire a janitor. Done. pop up in this notification thing and they just didn't tell me no you do my man use the sink while the janitor was there Operate this check in disk? Currently, there's no one. A service technician do? And do I have one? Dude, this shit's easy. Running an airport? Easy. Can't have food in this airport, apparently, but <laughs> easy though.
Oh, okay, here's the copy paste mode. Yeah, I guess if I just close the the thing, then I could turn it into a commercial line. I, I don't know how much of my income really comes from that. Like, how do I see that part? Hourly average, let's go. Runway usage fees. Change fees. There you go. That's the power right there. What does this want me to do? Take more con commercial flights? Oh, there you go. I just have to catch the plane as it's leaving. Okay, we'll leave these last two as uh, GA flights or whatever until... We get whoever automatically does the flight planning. Not that I like can't do it, it's just, you know, if they do it, then it'll be much better. just turn it into a two-lane road because they're not like they're not using it does this need chairs is that why no one's using this like laptop thing i'll check in on it later yeah we'll put food thingies in in here Maybe along here, I'm not really sure. Probably turn this into a staff zone. It's just so they don't walk out that door. And walk out the is that a song? Ooh, do we need another security checkpoint? Is that what's happening right here? saying we could like take the opportunity to just completely deconstruct all this and then reconstruct it mouse is creating a glow it's like why is it sunny right there dude look 
no flights depart from right here but this guy's like you know what i don't want to deal with any of these motherfuckers Some things will go wrong and you'll need to be prepared to handle difficult situation. Bird strikes, emergency landings, and medical emergencies are rare but do happen. It's time to build the infrastructure to take care of those events. Complete R&D emergency response. Okay, well. Are they going to use this road correctly when there's like a road here? Yeah, I'm just going to hope. gonna hope that having a two-lane road immediately will pump the traffic in some way okay yeah this is airport ceo you know what i'm saying we're just gonna we're just gonna keep getting more and more into it so uh can i see like a chart with my my money previous hour can i see it like over the whole thing you know what i'm saying that'll make me feel may be bad. I have unread message. Oh, million dollar bonus. You've been selected by the Department of Infrastructure and Transportation and winner of the Aviation Transportation. It is our belief that your airport will be of the greatest importance in Nashville. And will therefore transfer the amount of one million to your accounts receivable. We hope that the awarded funds come to good use. Hell yeah, they will. Bitch. Um, yeah. I feel like, um, you know, that's like, we're, we're barely scratching the surface. Like, I've done nothing so far. But, uh, it feels like I've done so much. Uh, but, you know, that's what happens when the game is mad complicated, right? Uh, so, yeah, maybe we'll check more of this out in the future. But, this, uh, again, Airport CEO. Available now on Steam. I, I don't know the price off the top of my head. Sorry. Oops. Messed that up. Row we ahead. Okay. Video games. 